This method is known as self-distillation without labels, or dyno. Here, we visualize the local attention maps. Compared to a model trained with supervised learning, the attention maps from dyno are cleaner and focus more on the object. Here are more examples. In the second version, the researchers enhanced the method by implementing a better centering technique for the logits, introducing a regularization term to encourage more diverse feature learning and expanding the output dimensions to 128,000. They also scaled the training data set to 142 million images and increased the train batch to 3,000. One interesting improvement is adding patch level losses, but how does that work? Both the student and teacher models use a vision transformer as their image encoder. In other words, before feeding the image into our model, we first split the image into smaller patches. We prepend a special learnable class token to a sequence of image patches. The class token's features encode a summary of the whole image, capturing its global context.